in this video i'm going to teach you guys how to get the different scales of different keys on your saxophone um so in order to get it first we need to understand what is chromatic scale you're going to use chromatic scale you're going to use ascendentals you're going to use semitones but first thing we need to know what is a chromatic scale chromatic scale is a scale containing the 12 different semitones in this video, I'm going to teach you guys how to um the, the meaning of semitone and I'll also explain what tone is. But that's later. So um 12 different semitones. A chromatic scale is a scale containing 12 different semitones. Um it's containing the 12 different keys on the saxophone. So let's start. Um let's take the key C of let's say um let's find the chromatic um let's take the chromatic scale of key C. Um, it has C. This is C. We are talking about it. Definitely start with C. Following, following it is C sharp or D flat. Following it is D. As you can see, following it is D sharp or E flat. Following it is E. Following it is F, and um, the rest you will get to um, the upper C. So it has um, they, are, they have their different sound. Do is C on the chromatic scale is C the first C is your do is C sharp or D flat is your D D low D and um, that D is called um accidental which is um, the accidental is sometimes put in, in, in um after a semitone semitone is moving like moving from one key to another from now we remove we moved to get the chromatic scale we moved from key C to key C sharp or D flat. So accidental is the D. That that's that sound that is making that C sharp or D flat is making in this particular chromatic scale. The chromatic scale for key C is the accidental, the D. The next one um your after C sharp or D flat is your D. That's re. And and the next one is um um your is um D sharp or E flat, which is really but most people some people call it more but um let's go with re um the next one is your E that's your me and that re let's I forget re is also an accidental so next one after re is your your after um D sharp or E flat is E, which is your me You're giving the sound me. Next one is F, giving the sound fa. Next one is F sharp or G flat, giving the sound um fi, fi. Also an accidental. Next one um after F sharp or G flat is your G, giving the sound so. Next one is G sharp or A flat, giving the sound C. That's also another accidental. Next one after it, um, after your um, G sharp or um, E flat, um, G sharp or A flat is your A, giving the sound La. La. The next one is A sharp or B flat, giving Li. But some people, some, some other people call it Tor. It's also an accidental. Next one is your B. That's your T. Normal major scale T. Last one is your C, which is your Do. So, uh, out of this, the different sound that different chromatic scale give, from, like C gives Do. So, in order to get the scale, we remove out all accidentals. The D, the Re, or more, the Fi, the C, the um, and the Li or Tor, we remove out all the accidentals. And we are talking about um, the chromatic scale of C. So when we remove out all the accidentals, we get the normal major scale for, for G C. That's what that would be. That would be Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Ti, Do. So in order to get to Re, from Do to Re, we Remove, we go from, um, we go tone, 
It will remove a tone, not semitone. Now, semitone means we are going from C to C sharp to D flat. But rather, we do not go to um, C sharp or D flat to get our read. We, we, we go. Tone means to move two times. Go C sharp or D flat, go to D. That's you have moved two times. That's you have gotten a tone, a tone, a tone movement. So that's how you get your um, major scale. Step that um, moving tone. Next one, move another tone. Next one, move um, three times now to get the next this thing to get the next notes. So C is your do, your D is your re, your E is your mi, your F is your fa, your G is your so, your A is your la, your B is your T, and the upper do is your C. Remove not all accidentals. Remove not all accidentals. So let's go to key. Um, let's say let's give it key C sharp or D flat. Yeah, C sharp or D flat. So the chromatic scale for it is C sharp or D flat. Next one following it is D. Next one following it is D sharp or E flat. Next one following it is E. Next one following it is F. Next one following it is F sharp. Or G flat. Next one following it is G. Next one following it is G sharp or A flat. Next one A. Next one A sharp or B flat. Next one um B. Next one C. And last one C sharp or D flat. So we can get Do to Do. C sharp or D flat Do. C sharp or D flat Do again. So from this, it's C sharp or D flat gives it. Um, since we are talking about C sharp or D flat now. It's kiss the C sharp or D flat gives two. The next one that's um D D like the letter D is giving the accidental D D I giving the accidental D. Next one D sharp or E flat is your is your um um D sharp or E flat or or E flat is your Ray. Next one after it is E. That's giving giving um making the sound gri or mo. Next one is F. M making the sound mi. And so on like that. So in order to know if you are correct, we test it. Um following let's follow this. Let's do the um C sharp key now. The C sharp key. Your do is your Let's remove all. Let's remove all all the accidentals. Remove all the accidentals. Your do is is C sharp or D flat, which if you have not, if you are if you followed my video, is this three. That's C sharp or D flat. Next, we don't we will not move a semitone now. We we'll move a tone. So we skip D. We go to because this bringing out is. We are making giving the accidental sound. And we're not using that. We want to get the major scale, which is do the mi fa so la ti do. So we go to D sharp or E flat. That's your day. <laughs> Next one is your E. Yeah, we are going to lift that one. So a tone movement to F. If you give it the mi. <laughs> Next one is next one we're going to go to eh, is going to be F sharp or G flat to get in order to get the fa because that is not giving is not giving um it's not giving an accident it's not giving an, an accidental sound. So we'll go to F sharp or G flat, which is your fa.
to get your saw. We're going to skip the G now. G sharp or A flat to get your saw. G sharp or A flat to get your saw. So your A now is going to be the C. We're going to skip that. And we're going to go to A sharp or B flat. That's 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 going to be your La. Next one um, is your T. That's your B. Sorry. Um, next one is your is your B. It's, it can be your T. Following the this thing, it's it's the M. Um, since your A sharp or B flat is going to be your La. Next one is going to be Li or Ta. So we're going to skip that. We're going to go to the next one. Let's go to the next um the, the next key. That will be your C. That will give you a C. Next one, we now go back to C sharp or B flat. So we have watched the video when we have seen how we got our different um, keys for how to get the different keys for different skills. So you get your different um sorry different skills for different keys for your different major skills. Do re mi fa so la ti do. So watch out for the next video. It's going to be I'm going to teach you guys how to um slow on um, slow with pentatonic scale how to perfect good slurs with pentatonic scale.